Welcome to the time for a meal. Potato balls with cheese and delicious shrimp in the dough. Try this recipe when quick and tasty bites are desired on the table. Mash the boiled potatoes. Finally chop the parsley and cheese. Hot the egg, chopped bacon, garlic, and season with salt and pepper. A teaspoon of ground paprika. Cut out cheese balls. In three bowls, prepare the beaten egg, flour, and bread crumbs. Take about a spoonful of prepared mass and form small ball in your hands. Place a cheese ball in the center of each and roll the whole thing into a ball with a cheese center. Repeat this step until you use up all the potato mixture. Heat a lot of oil in a pan. Coat each potato ball in flour. Egg. Add brint crumbs. a few bars at the time into golden brown. Then drain on the pepper towel. You can heat the ready balls for 5 minutes in the oven preheated to 200 degrees. The cheese will then melt perfectly and the breading will be crispy. You can also use a microwave. The heating time is shorter, about 30 seconds. If you like my recipe, remember to leave a like and subscribe. Pour dark beer, hot corn and wheat flour, baking powder, Old Bay seasoning, season with salt. It is important to make the dough well in advance, because it should stand for at least 15 minutes, so that the gluten contained in flour has time to break down and combine with water. Fill the shrimp without removing the tail, pour about half a liter of oil, into the pan and heat it up. Take the shrimp by the tile, dip it in the flour, then in the dough, and then to the oil. Fry in deep oil at least 160 degrees until golden brown for about 2 minutes. After removing, place on a paper towel to dry the excess oil. Peel the avocado and cut it into cubes. Also cut the tomato into cubes and combine with avocado.
add a lemon juice, season with salt and pepper. Add olive oil. Put two teaspoons of avocado and tomato in each cup. One shrimp per cup. Parsley leaves. Insert small forks. Bon appetit! Did you like it? Subscribe to be up to date. See you next time.